Hello guys, um, so if you have a similar ball head as me, which is a Manfrotto model number 322RC2, um, this ball head is a wonderful ball head because it has a grip release. So instead of turning a knob to adjust your ball head, you just basically press, it's like a pistol grip. It's very easy to use, but a lot of people have it, but the problem with this ball head is um, after a while, when after you use it for a while, it uh, it loses its locking tension. See, like mine here. Like even though I'm releasing my grip, it's still just like flapping around. So it's a really really super simple fix. And uh, the way to fix it, uh, you only need one tool, which is a three millimeter uh, hex wrench. And uh, the area you're going to be focusing on is actually um, there is a friction adjustment screw right over here. So if you, if you flip your um, pistol grip to the other side of the, um, the grip, you'll see there's a screw hiding down there, which uses a three millimeter uh, wrench to actually turn. So the only thing you need to do is just turn it very slightly clockwise and uh, for example like I'm showing you here because I already loosened it a lot but for you guys over there you probably only need to turn it just a little bit to lock the ball head tight okay and uh, also another thing to notice is you know there's a indicator for another friction control which is the friction of the movement of the grip when it's not when it's released so that that indicator have nothing to do with the friction of the ball head when it's completely locked okay so the only thing we're adjusting is the locking tension so right now it's locked and it's moving and you need to go in and adjust the friction for the locking tension and as you can see as I turn it's already gonna give it a lot of frictions I'm gonna turn it a few more turns and now you see it's like really really tight so and if I release it you can see it's like moving freely so um, and just remember that three millimeter screw is actually to adjust the locking tension and I'm gonna just adjust it just a, a little bit more because I like it really tight when it's locked okay Oops. And let's give it a try. And as you can see, like right now, it's like super, super tight. Like I have to use a lot of force to like move it around, which if you just have a regular camera on top, it's not going to be moving that much. Okay. Or it's not going to be moving at all. And uh, um, that's basically how you fix this um, loose locking tension on the Manfrotto 322RC2 heads. Um, I know there are some different models, say 324RC2 and 327RC2. The adjustment for the locking tension is all going to be the same. You're going to find a locking screw on the back of the pistol grip, and that's the area that you actually want to do uh, to lock or to fix the tension on the uh, ball head. Okay, so another thing very important that I actually forgot to mention is if you have a loose ball head, that's uh, when it's locked. Uh, also check on the um, condition of the uh, of the ball because sometimes after you use this grip head for a while, the internal uh, lubricants is gonna be leaking all over onto your ball from the area down inside. Uh, when that happens, you have to actually use a um, alcohol to spray onto the ball and clean it nicely. You don't have to disassemble the whole thing to clean the ball. You can just try to uh, wriggle around and find the rooms to clean all the areas. Um, but if it's necessary to disassemble uh, the pistol grip to clean it, it's also not very hard. Um, the only tough part when you are disassembling the um, pistol grip is um, there is a very strong spring over here. So when you lose this uh, four screws, and try to um, disassemble it, the spring and everything is gonna pop out. Um, and when the spring pops out, you have to use a lot of force to push the spring back. Um, also, there's a locking pin 
right over here when you open the case uh, that lock and pin have to be aligned nicely <clears throat> my trick for opening it for service is um, that's if it's very necessary or if your ball head is very very dirty and you are not able to clean it with alcohol just by um, cleaning from this area uh, when you disassemble uh, my trick for reassembling the ball head is that when you're assembling the everything together I usually just uh, actually slightly lock these two screws on the back and then when I put the spring back I can just because the back is locked I can just push the spring very nice very tightly inside push it all the way in and then I'm able to actually align the two piece together and then lock the other two screws and uh, that that is my trick for if you ever need to disassemble the ball head um, if not make sure you just clean your ball head very nicely with echo and uh, <clears throat> while you're doing the adjustment for the uh, tension locking screw okay so that was one thing that I forgot to mention and I want to add it back into the video and uh, that actually concludes this video if you guys have any more questions about how to fix a the lock intention on the uh, Manfrotto pistol grip ball head uh, feel free to ask me in the comment section otherwise uh, thank you so much for watching and uh, hope you guys find this video useful please hit like uh, if you do find it useful